uses sex as her weapon. I shouldn't say it because I'm not Kavya now. I'm Pauli. <laughs> Sitting, mm. erect, with a gun behind. Yeah. Oh, I just loved holding the gun. That was nice. Hi, I'm Pauli Ram and you're watching BollywoodHangama.com. Well, we have with us Pauli Dham, uh, the actress whom you have seen in the controversial promo of Hate Story, uh, doing the rounds right now, uh, making a lot of uh, news as well. Uh, pleasure having you on Bollywood Angama. Oh, thanks. My pleasure. Karna kya hai? Main shahar ki sabse badi banna chahti. The promo of your film uh, Hate Story uh, has been controversial. People have uh, taken a lot of uh, surprise value uh, for the entire lot of words which are there in the promo. Uh, what sort of reactions have you got? Ah, I got. Lovely, lovely. I mean, a lot of uh, what to say comments, and uh, there were a lot of calls, messages. People are liking it. Mm. It's they're seeing something which is different, mm. absolutely different. It's a thriller. Uh, it's a revenge drama. So there are a lot of emotions, uh, the lot of uh, turmoils. Uh, at the same time, you're do talking about dialogues. Uh, that, of, of course, the script is by Vikram Bhatt, right. <laughs> and. When I first gone through the you know script and I thought that these dialogues are, I thought means as an actor, so wow, this is challenging. That is what is uh, viewers who ever watched the promo and songs. Which are those dialogues? Uh, we can always beep it. <laughs> I don't think I, I, I want people to see it. I shouldn't say it because I'm not Kavya now. I'm Pauli. <laughs> Entire fact that um, you're playing um, a young woman who's uh, betrayed and uh, who's cheated upon, and how you just take your revenge. In fact, in that context, uh, do you think the entire uh, whatever excessive uh, the lovemaking scenes that we are seeing in the promo, do you think that they're required because they seem to be uh, very over the top? I do every job when I went through the script, I had gone through the script and the entire storyline, I felt it's absolutely apt for this genre and uh, this uh, film. I really liked the script and that's why I agreed in doing it. And it's very different, it's very unique in its own way. And that's why you are right now here, <laughs> isn't you talking to me? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. I worked in so many films in Bengal, but when I was doing something in Bollywood and stepping here, uh, in brand, Bollywood is a brand in itself. I'm, I'm just loving it. And the film is making a lot of difference. Uh, it's creating a lot of buzz around and uh, people have really liked it. They have seen something which is absolutely new. When a woman comes to her own love, then she can buy anyone from any man. You know, the difference is the way it has been shot. If you see the film, if you see the promo, the way it has been shot, the expression, the body language, the performance level and everything overall. That what I uh, really like about the film. In Hindi, when you say that that I'm a prostitute and, and stuff like that, and in general, when you're having your, your scenes with Mohan Kapoor, uh, that you have not used it, and then the entire uh, whatever yeah, happens in the... It's a revenge drama. But, but my question drama. is that it seems like uh, it's deliberately meant for shocking the, the audience, in fact. Uh. Shocking and, and titillating, in fact. No, I don't think it's titillating at all. It's very aesthetically short and sure. it's it's beautifully short. आप बड़ी शातिर हैं. कमाल का इस्तेमाल किया है मुझे. लेकिन आप शातिर नहीं हैं. आज तक आपने मुझे यूज़ नहीं किया. And uh, once you see the entire film, since it's a revenge drama and it's uh, women centric, and uh, this girl uh, who has been who was a journalist. You know, a media yeah. journalist, yeah. yeah. And she was a bubbly, simple girl, next to a girl. The way a normal girl changes, you know, just transformation. Why is this? Because she has been ditched and betrayed so badly. So, she uses sex as her weapon. Like, if she can be ditched that way, then she can also take on any guy, like any man. Right, you, you say that as well. Yeah. In the, in the, in the promo. In the promo. Okay, I, I wouldn't repeat it in fact. <laughs> Your first uh, visual that came out of the film was uh, the bareback uh, poster that yeah. came out. How is it? It's, it's very attractive. I think any <laughs> no normal man will say that. You know, it's, it's something which, which you can't take your, uh, your eyes off, obviously. In That's fact. exactly what was the motive. And this poster, it really uh, gives you the entire feel, feel of the film. It's an erotic thriller, but it's bold, it's beautiful, and the woman is very strong. So she's sitting mm. erect, you know, with a gun behind. Right. Oh, I just loved holding the gun. That was nice. Uh, like, she is a symbol of power. Yeah, power and I, I think she, she likes to be on top, in fact. Whatever he says. 
<laughs> I think the promo says it in fact. I'm not saying it. That is a symbol of, of power oh, as well. Oh, really? Women like this. I was reading Vivek Agnotri's interview and he was saying that uh, he's upset with the entire uh, strictures put by his uh, censor board. Are you just uh, bracing yourself for an uphill task with the censor board? Because apparently if the cuts will be imposed, then uh, the entire, I think, impact of the film may be diluted, in fact. I think this uh, Vikram or Vivek will be the best person to answer. But of course, uh, you see, after you shoot something, you feel good, you feel nice after when you watch it. Uh, if it doesn't stay for... Of course, sensor board or something else. As an actor, as a, as a performer, I would definitely feel bad. Because something I have done, it should be there.